do that is because I enjoy doing that. I enjoy working out. It's one of my favorite things in life, is just being in there hitting the iron. I love it. The fitness community was struck with grief when Rich Piana, a popular bodybuilder and fitness icon, passed away at 46. Despite his meteoric rise to fame in the mid-2010s, Rich's life was plagued by a battle against drug addiction, ultimately leading to his untimely demise. From an early age, Rich was driven to pursue his passion for bodybuilding. At 11 years old, he first picked up weights, and by 15, he was already stepping onto the competition stage. However, it was at 18 when Rich made a fateful decision that would alter the course of his life. He started using the Test and Dika steroid cycle, seeking to enhance his physique. The dramatic results he achieved only fueled his addiction, and before long, he was hooked. Despite this, Rich continued to dominate the bodybuilding world, winning notable titles such as the NPC Mr. California competition in 1998 and the Los Angeles Super Heavyweight Division in 2003, as well as the Sacramento Super Heavyweight Division in 2009. Rich's extreme popularity was more due to his social platforms. Piana ran a YouTube channel where he captivated audiences with his motivational speeches, workout tips, and a glimpse into his daily life through his day-in-the-life content. His personality, combined with his insightful content, earned him a massive following, with over 1.2 million subscribers on YouTube and an equally impressive 1 million plus followers on Instagram, Rich was one of the most beloved figures in the fitness world, inspiring and motivating millions with his work. Rich Piana's physique was the stuff of legends, and much of his popularity was due to the sheer size of his muscles. He made no secret of the fact that he used anabolic steroids to achieve his impressive build, admitting to a 27-year usage of the performance-enhancing drugs. In a 2014 video on his YouTube channel, he candidly spoke about his steroid use, beginning at the age of 18. While acknowledging the potential side effects of hair loss, adult acne, and unwanted weight gain, Rich stressed that he did not abuse steroids and instead used them responsibly. His openness about his steroid use was a breath of fresh air in an industry often shrouded in secrecy, and endeared him even further to his fans. In April 2016, via one of his YouTube videos, he advised his viewers that if they have a choice to stay natural without any drug use, then they should keep it that way. However, if you want to become a professional bodybuilder, then you have no choice but to use steroids. Sadly, Piana's warning about the dangers of steroid use proved to be prophetic, as he suffered an untimely death just a year later. While receiving a haircut from his partner, Chanel Jansen, at his home in Clearwater, Florida, Piana suddenly collapsed, hitting his head. Paramedics were called, but by the time they arrived ten minutes later, Piana's heart had stopped. Despite attempts to revive him, brain damage from lack of oxygen had already set in. At the scene, crushed white powder and straw were found on the table, leading paramedics to administer naloxone, a medication used to counter opiate overdoses. While speculation arose about drug use and foul play, Jansen maintained that Piana only used a high-caffeine pre-workout supplement and never recreational drugs. Despite being placed in a medically induced coma, Piana never regained consciousness and passed away two weeks later at the age of 46. The autopsy report listed the cause of death as unknown, with a multitude of potential contributing factors, including the inability to conduct a toxicology report. The autopsy of Rich Piana revealed a shocking truth about the effects of anabolic steroids on the human body. With findings of significant heart disease and an enlarged heart, it was clear that Piana's prolonged drug use had taken a toll on his health. Despite an inconclusive autopsy report, it is widely believed that the accumulation of drug use over 27 years ultimately led to his death. The fitness industry often glamorizes anabolic steroid use, but Rich's story serves as a sobering reminder of the dangers it poses. He was on excessive doses of steroids, putting a tremendous amount of strain on his body. Every vital organ was struggling to function, and the constant inflammation ultimately led to his untimely demise. Anabolic steroids may provide temporary gains, but they come at a high cost to one's health, as Rich tragically discovered. Thanks for watching. If you found this video informative and enjoyable, please give it a like.